Hi everyone, this is Melissa. I'm a seamstress here at White Dress by the Shore. One of the questions we get asked a lot, especially in the winter with a lot of destination weddings, is the best way to pack a dress for travel. So the best way, first and foremost, is to leave the dress hanging in its garment bag. So we always encourage brides to contact your airline and find out if they have a captain's closet that you can use. Sometimes uh, you can actually get all the way up to the airline day of and they will let you use it. Sometimes they won't give you that information over the phone. But if you're a little bit nervous and a little bit leery, we wanna show you the best way to pack it in a carry-on just so you can have it with you at all times so there's no risk when you're traveling. So we've got our sample dress here. And the first thing I like to do is take the garment bag that it comes in and I lay it out unzipped on the floor. And then I'm gonna take the gown and I'm gonna lay it out on top of the dress with the top up and the train down to the floor. So once I get it kind of spread out into its shape, the first thing I'm gonna do is fold in this sort of flare at the bottom. So whether it's an A-line or a flare gown, it is gonna have some space kind of continuing out past the bag. And you're gonna to wanna to just roll that in. So once I get it in on itself, I resituate it and I'm gonna pull up the train a little bit. And same thing, in this case, I'm just gonna tuck the train tips around the edge. Now I'm all the way up to the zipper line now. Sometimes the zipper goes all the way to the floor and that's fine too. All the way to the bottom of the bag, I should say. So we're gonna tuck this into the bag. All the way up. So now I know that it's kind of in here nicely placed and I'm gonna take this front part and I'm gonna fold it down. So I'm almost just kind of folding it in half, still within the garment bag. Now I'm going to go ahead and zip the bag up and I fold the top of the garment bag over and I'm going to fold the bottom of the garment bag right where the dress is, kind of use that as my guide and get it here. So now I have it a little bit more in a controlled sort of dimension and then I'm going to fold it one more time onto itself and what it does is it gives a bunch of fabric sort of in the way of the dress. So instead of everything sitting just on itself getting creased, it has a little bit more like girth to roll over itself so it won't be as wrinkled when you're packing it. So then I'm gonna take it, I'm just gonna kind of curl my edges down and I've got my carry-on right here. And I'm just gonna go ahead and tuck it in. And you'll see that it fits really nicely and you'll be able to zip it up and just store it overhead. Now you'll notice too that we used a little bit of a smaller size gown. So what we're gonna do for, ne for you next week is we're gonna demonstrate how to um, seal up a bigger ball gown or a gown that maybe has more layers and tool on the bottom.